Greetings to everyone. This is your host Ash Khan and you are watching Consumer Pakistan News Channel. In today's bulletin, Federal Minister decision about closure of schools. Federal Minister for Education and Professional Training Shafqat Mahmood said that the decision to close schools is very difficult and a detailed review of the coronavirus situation would be taken on March 24. The minister was addressing a ceremony in the provincial capital where he also spoke about the demerits of online education. The Ministry of Education warns that the educational institutions should remain open and we took a number of steps during COVID-19. Shafqat Mahmood said there is a difference between in-person and online learning and closing schools is a very difficult decision. Earlier on Sunday the minister said that all education and health ministers will sit together on Wednesday and take decisions regarding the reopening or further closure of educational institutions in the country amid the rising number of COVID-19 cases. Facebook to initiate projects in Pakistan advisor to chief minister Khaibar Pakhtunkhwa on science and technology and information technology informed that Facebook wants to initiate a number of projects in Pakistan. Pangish said that the, they had an important meeting with Facebook's representative, Seher Tariq. He informed that under the instructions of CMKP, they have offered Facebook to open their Pakistan office in the province and has committed to offering full support in this regard. He informed that during the meeting, they made a commitment with Facebook to review the legalization which is causing hardships to Facebook and other social media platforms. We should support platforms such as Google, YouTube, Facebook as a majority of our youth is connected to them, he said. Bangash said that they are in talks with Facebook to open up its monetization in Pakistan. He informed that as per Facebook officials, over 50 million Pakistanis are using the social media platform. Bangash said that the Speaker National Assembly, Asad Kaysar, will conduct meeting with Facebook officials alongside Ministry of IT and officials. PMD forecast dry weather in most parts of KP and GB. Pakistan Meteorological Department forecasts dry weather in most parts of the country while cloudy weather with chances of rain, snow over high mountains at a few places in Upper Khyber Pakhtunkhwa, Kashmir, Gilgit Baltistan and Potohar region during morning hours in next 24 hours. A strong westerly wave is affecting the upper and central parts of the country and may persist in upper parts till Wednesday morning, Met Office reported. Rain thunderstorm occurred in Islamabad, Punjab, Khyber Pakhtunkhwa, North Central Balochistan, Kashmir, Upper Sindh and Gilgit Baltistan, while snowfall occurred in Kalam, Malam Jabba and Astor. LG might shut down its smartphone business. After several unsuccessful attempts at selling its smartphone business, LG might be planning to shut it down. According to Bloomberg, the company was involved in negotiations with the German Volkswagen AG and Vietnamese Win Group JSC on possible sale of its smartphone division. However, those negotiations seem to have failed. In January, the CEO at LG Electronics also explained that the company is actively considering all the available options for this loss-making segment. The company has also decided to halt its plan to launch new smartphones. LG's rollable phone Rainbow has also been placed on an indefinite hold for now. In addition to this, LG is also planning to relocate its workforce to other business divisions like automobile parts and household appliances. However, the company has not shared its final decision about the smartphone business with its workforce as yet. The company might offer more details about this decision to its employees next month. Pakistan launches its first ever tourism TV channel. In accordance with Prime Minister Imran Khan's vision of driving mainstream development towards tourism, 
The government has taken a major step in this direction by launching Pakistan's first ever TV channel specifically for tourism. For Discover Pakistan on its management's official social media accounts, the new platform is focused on promoting Pakistan's scenic beauty, historical places and notable areas. The channel covers tourism related events and developments and airs a morning show to showcase a soft image of the country. Since its launch on Saturday 22nd March, Discover Pakistan is broadcasting its content in high definition to promote Pakistan's natural landscape in the best way possible. Before Discover Pakistan grew into a mainstream development project, PM Imran Khan had formulated a 12 member tourism specific national coordination committee in August last year to oversee its progress. The committee is also responsible for overseeing the implementation of the government's national tourism strategy while adhering to provincial and regional policies. Thank you for watching Consumer Pakistan News Channel. This is I Ash Khan. See you in the next bulletin. Until then, take care and goodbye.